community hit the brakes during the pandemic, sand drags are back and bigger than ever in Yuma County. That's exciting. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of fun. Our very own Adam Klett brings us to the special report on our desert drag races. On the other side of the Gila Mountains sits a strip of dirt with a lot of history. Here with this racetrack that has a lot of world records. It's the Dome Valley Raceway. Established in 1996, it attracts racers from across the country and even Mexico. But it has a special meaning to the Zavala brothers who run the Looney Race Team. Both my brother and I race competitively. We travel throughout the United States drag racing. But it's special racing in their own backyard. From Somerton, Alfonso and Tommy have been coming to the track to race since they were six years old. Today, they don't race side by side, but say the sibling rivalry is still strong. Fortunately for him, we don't race in the same class. <laughs> but if we did, I'm pretty sure I'd, I'd be loading them up. In this type of drag racing, it's not who gets down the track fastest wins. Racers trying to get to the finish line in 2.95 seconds and not a millisecond sooner, or else you're disqualified. When you're sitting behind the thing, you know, you're only going down this track um, for three and a half seconds at you know 90 miles an hour, but in those three and a half seconds, you're thinking of so many things that's going on behind the wheel. But even though winning isn't a matter of who hits the gas pedal first, these dragsters still hit blazing speeds. This is the blown loony top eliminator dragster, and when Tommy is behind the wheel like I am right now and presses the pedal to the metal, it reaches speeds of up to 120 miles an hour. But the Zavala brothers say I can't go for a test drive and make me get out of the dragster. It's Tommy's turn to get behind the wheel and go on his first qualifying run. And it's a near perfect time of 2.954 seconds. All possible thanks to his family team. Man, going to the track and knowing that he's there, my dad, my kids, it's a, it's a good feeling. It's a good feeling to have that support. Reporting in Welton, Adam Klett. News 11.